You know, maybe I spoke too soon about the children's faces. I think maybe this guy looks a little bit too much like that guy. Old miner. Oh, he's an adult. So there's a chance I'm an adult. Hey there, X. You've been starting to look a bit more grown up. If Cole were here, he'd be so proud of you. Cole, that's my dad. He went missing when I was a baby. I don't know the reason he left home. He just never came back. Apparently, we are really similar. So, he used to say he wanted to see the world all the time. That's why it's rumored that maybe he really did leave the village. I mean, if he didn't, I guess that just means he was murdered <laughs> and his body was never found. Dad used to be a miner, right? Also, I noticed while I was editing the video, the first video, that they interchanged minor with minor. So when they said miners weren't allowed in the tavern the first time, it was minor with an O, meaning underage. But then every subsequent time, it was with an E. So now I don't know if it was a pun, or if it was just typo. He sure was a minor. The best I know. He helped me out countless times. I meant to ask at Wow, that's a really bad name for your main character. Uh, the kid that tried to sneak into the castle the other day. It was you, wasn't it? No, 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 no. <laughs> you don't have to hide it. Only you're a rascal enough to come up with something like that. You're a cool son, after all. You really make it sound like you know more than you're leading on, sir. If you really are a sir. Hmm. Just, I'm just admiring the, uh, the scenery. I really do like some of the designs. I really wish I could actually interact with stuff. Hey there, X. Let's make a good day. You late, X. Everyone's already here. Like, same model. Like, right next to each other. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Hey, Axe, how's it going? Oh my gosh. Supervisor. X, wait a minute. Before I let you in, I gotta ask, what are the three rules of mining? I ask all of my employees this every day. What are the three rules of mining? Where are they again? Hmm, what's going on? Read his mind? What kind of answer is this? If I can't remember in my mind, I'll just read yours instead. Alright, I don't have the power to read people's mind. Yeah, I didn't think you did. Sorry, I, I forgot. What? I told you to remember them. I tell everyone to remember them. Look, kid, rules are important. I can't let you in the mine unless you can say all three mining rules. Well, I guess I'll just have to ask around. Luckily, there's five people just sitting here. You want to remember the three rules of mining? I used to when I was younger, but I can't remember anymore. Ah, that's it. Wasn't it something like, take it easy? If you push yourself all the time, it can be tiring, you know? So we all gotta learn to relax a little. Take it easy at work. Well, it would be great, but... I learned the keyword, take it easy. Yeah, X, what's up? The three rules of mining, of course I remember. The first rule is say hello. You can't be a decent miner if you can't even greet your team. That's it, say hello, I gotta stay polite. Stay polite. You learn the keyword, say hello. Right. Hey X, you're taking a break already? It's important to take rests, but you just got here. You gotta work to help your mom out, you know? I'd rather train myself to be a soldier than take rest. Than keep where take rest. I guess that's the three rules total. Should I ask around more? I have a feeling that there's more. Let's do our best and work hard today. That's right, work hard. I even forgot that, huh? Hmm, three rules of mining. That's easy. Mining's dangerous work. 
That's why before you dig, you gotta check your tools. That's right, check your tools. It's a safety procedure. Well, I've talked to everyone around, so I should be good. Does that mean I just have to pick and choose one? Alright. So X, do you remember the three rules now? Alright then, recite three rules for me. All three rules. Okay, well... Work hard's gotta be one. Absolutely, you gotta work hard. What are the other two? Check your tools. That's right, it's important to check your tools. Okay, the last rule. Hmm, I don't think it's take it easy. I wanna say it's take rest. That would make, like, the most sense. You don't wanna overwork yourself if you're in the mine. It is kind of a dangerous job. Saying hello, though, this is a children's game. I wouldn't put it past it to make that one of the rules. Also, that sign in the background just says the alphabet. Let's try take rest. What? Take rest? Hold on there, resting is important, but... Yep. You have to remember the three basic rules. Basics are important, if you can't recite them, I can't let you in. Yep, yep, it's say hello. You didn't say hello to me, X. Sorry. Say hello. Correct, you have to say hello. Okay, you got all of them right. Now, don't forget them again. All right, man, let's work hard, huzzah. Great, fantastic. Okay, let's finish this up. Finish it, you just got here, my guy. Okay, man, good work. Let's call it a day. Yes, sir. Wonderful. And here I was thinking I'd have to play a game. Well, that took forever. Guess training will have to wait until tomorrow. Oh. I guess if the company doesn't see me put this in my pocket... Is there something over there? What the heck is this? Some kind of red precious stone in a mine? That we mine for precious stones? I don't know that. I don't know what they mine for. The next day. Oh, he's got one right there. He's a little thief, isn't he? Wow, I've just been feeling really energetic since yesterday. Ever since I found that stone. I wonder if there's any correlation. I feel like I'm going to be able to become a soldier in no time. Oh, it's going to be like a... Some kind of... Wow, they're, they've got stones everywhere. There are a whole bunch of thieves. Ah, you look happy today, Axe. Yes, I am. I meant to ask. That man from the other day is a soldier from the castle, isn't he? Yep. He's probably here on an important mission. Don't you go causing him any trouble. I won't. Anyway, I gotta go, Mom. Hey, I'm not done with you yet. That confidence of yours is what worries me. Listen, I just scolded you the other day. Don't you go causing trouble for people in the castle again. Okay, okay. Train with Engard. Like, you can't interact with anything. This is kind of disappointing. I wonder what that soldier. I wonder what that soldier came to our village for. Yeah, probably nothing important. Don't say that in front of him. But I'm just saying what he said. Hmm. There's no bed in here. This is a very tiny place. See. I'm gonna look just because of that exclamation mark. Can I do anything here? Maybe that just means like it's a transition to another area type thing. Is this how big the town is? I guess there's stuff down there. What is that? It's a sign. Okay. X. Anticipating something today? I can see it on your face. Not really. You're late again. Meanwhile, I've gotten leagues stronger than you. <laughs> All thanks to Mr. Angard's training. So, you want to prove it then? Come on. That's enough now. Training is something you do daily to gradually hone your skills. You two are just beginning. You're not just going to get strong overnight. 
Yeah, Axe. You listening? I don't know. I feel amazing today. I think I could even beat you, Ankard. <laughs> is that so? It's good that you have confidence, but being arrogant is dangerous. Oh yeah? Then why don't you try fighting me without holding back? Because then I would cut you in half. You don't want that, trust me. No, no. There's no way I could fight a mere child with my full strength. But perhaps someone should bring you down a peg or two. Alright, Hex. You asked for it. Oh, so I'm going to anyway? Please have mercy. Of course. What? Ah, my back. Mr. Ancard, are you alright? I'm, I'm sorry. What happened, Axe? What the heck did you suddenly learn to do that crazy attack like that? Mr. Ancard, about continuing my training. I do want to continue with your lessons, but... <sighs> oh. I think it might be difficult with my back like this. Hey, Axe. Because you got lucky and knocked down Mr. Angard. Now he can't train me. My bad. Well, then that's it. You know what we have to do now. Fight me. Huh? Why? If our teacher is down, beating you will be my training. Right, Mr. Angard. I should be just as strong as Axe. It'll be a piece of cake. Uh... Maybe. Perhaps you might be getting ahead of yourself. Besides, it's too narrow to fight right here anyway. Is it? We've been doing that. Alright, Axe. We'll fight somewhere else. Come over here when you're ready. If you don't, chicken out. Right. Did I not call it, or did I call it? How can you get so strong in just one day? X, go easy on him. Oh, so I was kicking your ass. <laughs> okay. Oh, where are we going? Let Mr. Scarecrow, Snowman. I really kind of wish I could move the camera more than this. That's the extent of the up and down. Fantastic. I really like this tree. A little gradient goes a long way. Oh, there he is. Are you ready? Yeah, I guess. Ooh, he's got some strong attacks. He's got three POW! PP? What's POW in- okay. As you can see, when the battle starts, Axe will come up with five random ideas. To avoid receiving damage from a tox attack during this turn, draw using tight guard to protect yourself. In the next turn, you'll come up with a new idea, so you'll have a total of five to work with again. Use tight guard to endure this turn. Oh, I see. It takes all three. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. But that did answer my question. I do get five. Maximum? And then I gotta use it again because I can't turn any more ideas into deserts. It seems unproductive though because I have so many moves left and he's so wide open, but I just don't have the power for it. Did you notice that the gauge in the middle of the screen rise? That's the energy level of the redstone axe has. The energy level rises a little each turn. Once the power is full, Axe gains one extra power to use in the following turn. So the more turns you fight, the more actions Axe can take. What the heck? At the end of each turn, there's a change of location. You will have to move one to four spaces within the area, which is decided by roulette. Try pressing the confer- This is out of left field. Why would I want to move? I can't kick his ass this turn. Oh, and we're going that way. And I have to go three. Okay, this is the location you will fight in the next turn. Hmm. Two, 
two and a three. But what does the three represent that the meter's filling up? It looks like you've come up with an idea, Dash Guard, during this turn. Dash Guard has a special effect that works when you successfully break an enemy's Daz it. Try using Dash Guard to see what happens. Gain free mobility. I have to break it though, which means I'd have to use it on the neck. No. When I break theirs, so I guess I can use it. I guess the only thing you do in those is just try and break each other. You have gained free mobility from the special effects of Dash Guard. Free mobility allows you to choose your next location within range, instead of having to move depending on the roulette. This becomes very important later. Please try to make good use of it. Okay. The enemy only has one Dazzit left. Now it looks like any idea will help you achieve an all break. Go for it. What's headspace? Oh. I move? No, I can't move right now. Okay. Well, I want to use like a weak one, don't I? This one is plus one or plus zero to one random Dazit when made into a Dazit. Half a chance of dealing one damage to the enemy's Dazit, but I have to receive the attack directly. So those two are the same, which is dumb. If I use this one, then I can like actually use it twice. And then will it be their next turn? I guess I should have used something else. One BP. What does that mean? How did I get one BP? You've just received one breakpoint. Breakpoint is earned when you successfully achieve an all break, but don't have a red Dazit to use in the chance turn. All oh, right, because I need a red one. BP is useful in a pinch. We'll just keep it for now. The turn is over. It's time to change your location. I don't think there was a way to have a red one that turn. Because if I had used a red one, it would have just broke. You have free mobility, so now you can choose which space to land on. You can go back one to four spaces or move forward one. That's stupid. Look, Niels is nearby. Try moving to the space where he is. How? Did it not just say I can go one to four backwards? This is forward. Allows random isits to be changed to dazits. Okay. That sounds OP as heck. So if all the battles are like this, I don't imagine the game actually being all that long. Axe, I think I came up with something. Let me know if you want to try it out. Oh, is he my buddy now? It looks like Nils is going to support you in this battle. When you fight in a location where a friend is, you get their support. You can press the L button to check out what kind of support you can receive from them. Yeah, let's do it. Especially if I can use that multiple times. And so that just takes nothing. Okay, well, let's take that one. And if I... Oh, I should have done this one, huh? Um, I think either way I'm gonna win, win this. This turn. Because I either have a three or a four left. Because this one doesn't matter, right? It doesn't... It's just about breaking, so even if he has more attack than I have defense... You know? Oh, and I have... Well, I guess I'll use it, right? That's what it told me to do. Can I use my other one? It's not. So power went up to four. What does that mean? Oh, wonderful. 
I forgot how, oh. I guess that was an ability that let me move. I was gonna say, I forgot how to do it. Power, I assume that's power level. But what do I do with that? Okay, so I have this one. Oh yes, one more thing. Ideas that disappear as they get broken and used up, yeah? So it's best to defeat your enemy as quickly as possible and before you run out of ideas. I only have a limited number of ideas. However, whenever Axe receives damage to his hearts, old ideas will get revived in his headspace. As long as you have hearts left, you should be fine. To know how many ideas you have left, you can always check your headspace. Have a look in there sometime to keep track of your ideas. But I can't like, can't move these. Oh, I can. But see, when it says three damage, does that mean two his dazits? Gain one improv idea. Huh. Oh, these are the BP. So can I like swap it to that one? I want to use that. Oh, shit. Does mine activate first? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Wonderful. Kiss my butt. Oh, yeah. And then activate them, right? Gain zero and one all deserts. Gain one improv idea. Well, let's do this. Can't use right now. Okay. Let's do this. So can I use this one? No. Nope. And a four. But let's use this one because I don't want to get rid of it. Is that going to do four hearts? Or does it only do one? Just one. Okay. So every direct attack is just one heart. Which means at minimum you have to do three all breaks. Wow, that was totally random. I forgot how to get BP though. You just have to break them all? No, because I broke them last time. It looks like you're doing alright. Here's a tip about using BP. By using BP, you can swap out ideas. Yeah, I did that already. You can also use it to revive ideas. If you ever thought, oh, I wish I could use Pelt right now. No, I'm out of ideas, but I can't afford to take damage. It's exactly when you should use BP. Swapping and reviving ideas are done in your headspace. That's it. Good luck in battle. Okay, so it does not matter what ideas I use. Struggle. Okay, so I assume that's like in Pokemon, where it's like if you don't have any moves left. Um, yeah, I guess I can use these, right? Oh shit, but that's gonna attack me, isn't it? Um, plus two, plus one to all. And it's three, that's good. Adds times the total number of yellow deserts available. Okay, that doesn't count as a turn then, good. And then I wanna use it. Because then, it doesn't matter. Just use my three. No. Use my five. <gasps> Frick! Oh, that was an accident. But does that count as an all break? Because I have extra moves. That was such an accident. Dang it. I scrolled through my moves and I accidentally clicked past it. Oh my gosh, the battle animations are just so long. Oh no, I could have beat him. Okay, well this one, this one will give me plus one defense. And it gave me firecracker, which is three damage to one random. Which is fine, because that'll break two of them. And 
this will give plus one to any random. Which means that if I use this... Use that one. And then I need to break a three. Do I? Yes. Oh, that's a four. Okay, I'm starting to get the hang of this, I believe. And I'll use my low numbers. Although I wonder if, like, the point additions last. Like, are they persistent through turns? Or do they reset? Because that would be its own little strategy. Oh my gosh, the battle animations need to... Chill. Hmm. That was an even fight. Not bad, Axe. Wow. I didn't expect to hear my rival say something like that. Was it? Really? Both of you did pretty well. Ouch, ouch, ouch. My back. Mr. Angard, are you alright? Hey, Axe. What if a monster comes while Mr. Angard is injured? He's in no shape to fight. I have a feeling a monster is going to come while he's in no shape to fight. I don't want to fight monsters, even when I'm healthy. But that was impressive, X. You seem to have some kind of power. Matak, you suck. X. Ah, oh, mom's calling. Sir, I hope it's not my son's fault that you hurt. Well, this is embarrassing. Axe's blow was so strong it knocked me all over. I think I can't work with an injury like this, so... I was going to ask Axe to do the job for me. <laughs> Ouch. I'm terribly sorry for the trouble he's caused. Wait, it isn't what you... Your son is quite formidable. Axe, it's almost dinner time. I'm sure you're hungry. I've cooked some of your favorite dinner, so come home soon, okay? Stomp, stomp. The calm before the storm. Your mom's the scariest when she suddenly turns so unnaturally sweet. Well, if this is the calm before the storm, I guess I gotta go home and try not to get blown away. See y'all tomorrow. See ya. Well, that took forever. So I'm gonna end this video here. After I talk to these guys real quick. We're getting scalded a lot lately. See you later, Axe, if you're still alive. He actually does seem a lot more friendly now, all of a sudden. Did I say anything wrong? Well, you did tell me you wanted me to do your job. Which was weird. Anyway, 